Alright, hello everybody, welcome back to another video. Today I'll be doing a, another bell collection video. This one's actually updated. And, yeah. I thought I had 13, I thought I had 14. I actually apparently have four, uh, 13, so yeah. So let's just get into the bell collection. Alright. So basically we're going to start down here. We got the United States Championship right there. This is the current United States Championship. Has the eagle, has the flag. It says champion. It says United States, WWE logo. Side plates. And then, like, it can show you how thick this is. It's specifically the eagle that's thick. And then it has, like, that texture and everything like that. Then you're continental. Then there's universal, the blue one. And this one, it has two globes, has the WWE logo right there, and then it has uh, a side plate right there, and our side plate right there. Then moving on to the Universal. This one, it has the red swoosh, has really nice stones and everything. It says Universal Champion. It has side plates, has the red stones right there. Yeah, and then there's a side plate right there. Then the same thing mirrored on the other side. Yeah. Then uh, moving on, we got the WWE Championship right here. This one specifically has good stones, just like the Universal has the red swoosh. It says World Heavyweight Champion. Then it has the uh, the clear stones instead of the red ones. On this one, it has side plates right there, sidebars. Everything like that, and instead of having a blue strap, it has a black strap. Yeah. Then we have the uh, world, the WWE World Championship, has the exact same one as that one. This has ba bad stones, as you guys can tell, it has really bad stones, not really good. Then it has Sephiroth side plates on there. I put Sephiroth side plates on there, and these are custom made by myself. Yeah. And then moving on. We got the Universal. Now, this one, it actually is custom. I, I will show you how it's actually custom. I got to turn on the light real quick. I'll show you how it's actually custom. Because usually it has a black swoosh. This one actually has the red swoosh. I actually switch out the main plate. And then it actually has really nice stones. And that has the red strap. Then it has sidebars, uh, side plates. They cannot change the side plates because it's commemorative and everything like that. But you can change the main plate. I managed to do that because obvious reasons. I like my belts being unique. And then it has the belt tip right there. And also some future things for this belt. I will plan on getting this signed by Seth Rollins. Uh, eventually when I get like a job and everything. And I can go to WWE live events. I will eventually get this signed by Seth Rollins. Because he was my favorite person to actually hold this belt. And I do really want to get this signed by him. So yeah, then moving on, we have both the Raw and SmackDown Tag Team titles. This one has the red strap, this one has the blue strap, silver plates, no difference. And then I did modify this one, this one actually has the black WWE logo instead of the silver one. And then this one has the black WWE logo instead of the silver one as well. Then it has the two Gladiator helmets, uh, two Gladiator helmets right there, uh, Samoan something... Like, I don't know, like Samoan uh, type of side plates. And um, and actually, a little bit of thing about this one. This one's actually beaten up because we I did use this one in like, and I was using this one as like a training because me and my friend Ben, we actually used to do training. Not like professional training for wrestling. We used to do amateur training inside my trampoline. Everything like that. And that's uh, part of the reason why it has that crack in the center plate right there. If you guys can tell. It has like a little giant crack in there. Then of course it has a whole bunch of scratches on it. Because we were actually training with it. And then it actually managed. Then it managed to get cut open on the back. Then the belt managed to get cut open on the back when we were actually training. Well when we were wrestling. So yeah. And then we got the spinner belt right here. Of course spins and everything. You can make it look like The Miz. You can make it look like John Cena's belt. 
or it could just spin plain. So yeah. And of course it has that nameplate right there and it says champ. It has the eagle right there. It has a texturing in the back of the plate. Now of course this actually has a really thickness of a plate. That's how thick the plate is. The plates are actually combined. They are actually one thickness. So yeah. And then we have the uh, old NXT Championship, actually the 2016 version of the NXT Championship. This one's actually pretty nice. It has uh, the NXT that has the side plates, imitation side plates, I should say. That has imitation female snaps and imitation male snaps. So yeah. And also it does have an imitation belt tip that I probably cannot show. Actually, I could show it right now. It has an imitation belt tip right there. And of course, if you flip it over like this, it's not a belt tip. It's just a one-piece belt tip. Well, not a one-piece belt tip. It's a, uh, t uh, what do you call them? If one of you guys can let me know in the comments down below, because I'm pretty sure it's just a one-piece belt tip. I know it's not a one-piece belt tip, but it's just, it's just a tip that just says, that, like, a, I don't know what to call it. Like a half of a belt tip. Because it's like, I'll show you. It's like half of this one. Like, if you guys can see the little crease in there. And the universal one. It's like a half of a belt tip, I guess. Actually, no, we're just going to call it half of a belt tip. But then, moving on. Moving on to these ones right here. You have the, uh, the old, current, the old nice, oh my god. The old NXT Championship. That used to be in 2020. It has NXT WWE logo. It says champion. Side plates. I put. I put. Oh my god. I put Prince Balor uh, side plates on there. I think these actually look, look pretty nice. And then the second one right there. Then it actually does have a hint of silver in there a little bit. If you guys can see right there. And then moving on to the AEW championship. Now. If you guys definitely have seen the AEW Championship, uh, you guys definitely have seen the AEW Championship on my channel. We, me and my cousin Aliana did a basketball challenge video for this particular AEW Championship. And then I put her nameplate on there. I don't have the nameplate on there right now. The nameplate is currently right here, actually. Actually, I got the nameplate right here. The nameplate's actually right there. I just haven't taped it back on there. I just haven't taped it back on there yet. So it's right there. There's the nameplate right there. I just haven't taped it back on there because I I wanted to be relinquished. So I guess. And then we had the blue Universal Championship, another blue one. It has the uh, blue strap. It has the black swoosh instead of the red swoosh because I swapped them out. As I said, that main plate used to be on this one. This name plate used to be on that one. So yeah. And then of course it has side plates, sidebars. And it has that tooling, the nice tooling in the background. I like that tooling. It pops more than that one, I could say. And then, right here, it has a belt tip right there. Three-piece belt tip. So, yeah. But if you guys did enjoy this video, leave a like. Subscribe if you're new. Comment down below. I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.